Hey guys, it's Danny, and today I have a new subscription kit type opening review video for you. Um, I wanted to try out the Simon Says Stamp, I guess it's like the card kit making subscription thing. Um, I just got the one off. I didn't like subscribe officially because I just wanted to try it. Um, especially because of my previous experience with Simon Says Stamp, which um, I'll leave the link to that video below. But um, I will say that having received this now and looked through it, I'm pretty happy with it. Um, first reason is because this time the order came in a nice box, which I always really do appreciate. And I feel like the items in here are really cool. Um, I don't know if I'll be getting this like full time, um, but I'm gonna think about it. So anyway, let's see what came in here. So we get the box, and then I already did look at everything because I wanted to kind of see how it was before sharing it with you guys. So everything that was in this box came in this bag that was inside of the box. <laughs> so anyway, it's just got their label and it's a nice bag. And then what came with the kit is like an inspiration sheet with some different kind of cards and whatnot. I don't really make cards, so um, I got this more as like kind of a crafting supply kit. So it came with, let me see, I think it came with three, no, it came with four pieces of cardstock. So there's a black, a pink, um, a white, and a red. The white one's my favorite. It's like super smooth, I really like it. So they're Valentine colors. And the whole kit is kind of Valentine's themed. Um, I don't have a ton of Valentine's stuff at the moment. I've really been kind of holding back on buying some stuff. But I loved the stamp set and I loved the little die that came with it. So I was like, well, maybe I'll just get this one Valentine's thing. Anyway, so it comes with these really cute sequins. So there's like a light kind of rosy pink, some gold ones with the centers cut out and then some red hearts. So I think these are really pretty. I do like them. And then next is the stamp set that I just mentioned. And I like this one because it says hello beautiful and friend and a bunch of different like little hearts and things and yay and whatnot. And there's only one like truly Valentine's stamp on it, which I also liked the idea of because I don't need a bazillion things that say Valentine's Day. And these have a lot of different options. Um, the kit also came with a little lollipop, which I think is fun. I got the grape one. I'll probably give this to my kiddo. He will enjoy that. Um, next are some frazy kind of stickers. And they do... I'm sorry about the glare. Here, let me take this out. So that you don't have to see the glare because glare is terrible. Anyway, let's get... If I can get them out, that would be really great. Oh my gosh. Come on, stickers! Goodness gracious, what is happening? Okay. All right, so now we got the stickers out. So these ones say things like Happy Valentine's Day, Sweetheart, Cutie Pie, Love You, XOXO, Be My Valentine. Now there are a lot of Valentine's stickers on here, so I don't know what I'm gonna do with a bazillion Valentine's Day stickers, but maybe I will just keep the sheet for 10 years and <laughs> use it up by then, I don't know. Anyway, I really do like the ombre kind of coloring of the stickers, I think that's cool. So yeah, so I'm excited about this mainly for like these frazy small ones down here. Um, that, yeah, so that's cool. Um, I also got a half little booklet of 6x6 six six paper by Crate Paper. Um, in all honesty, I thought these were going to be 12x12 12 12 sheets. So I'm a little bummed that they're only 6x6, six six, but that's my own fault. I didn't read the thing close enough, I guess. Just fine. Oh, that one's really pretty. So, and they are not double-sided. I like these hearts, but I think the colors are really cute, and I do like Crate Paper as a brand, so I'm not surprised that I do like the patterns and whatnot on this. It's really pretty and cute. So yeah, excited to use those up. I think these will be great for like flip books or pocket letters or whatever kind of crafting I get into. <laughs> and then next are these tiny little heart dies. I think they are so adorable. And I don't currently have a die machine, but I am really seriously considering getting a Sizzix. Um, for a few different reasons that I won't go into in this video, but um, I have slowly kind of been building a little bit of a stash of dies, so I thought these were adorable and could be used on so many different things, so I'm excited to have those. And then last but not least um, are these crepe paper 
Valentine stickers. So they're slightly raised. Um, they're really glossy, which I think is cool. And I like, again, that there's just like not a ton of Valentine specific ones. So I could use these year round, really. I love this heart. So yeah, so I'm really excited to use these. Um, I think they're like a fun size, so I don't usually use stickers quite this large on my projects, so I think that'll be kind of a fun challenge, but I really do like the colors. I like how they coordinate perfectly with the paper, so if I wanna make a project, I can use these together. So that was everything in my Simon Says Stamp. Um, like I guess subscription thing. I don't know if I'll be subscribing permanently to the kit. I feel like it's a good value, but also that I'm slightly underwhelmed just a little bit. So I don't know again if I will be getting this again. I'm gonna wait and see kind of what the March one looks like because they do show you ahead of time what's in the kits. Um, so I know there are stamps are like $15 and up and the dies are not cheap either so um, the whole kit just to buy like the one-off kit um, is $30 plus shipping which I feel is kind of high I know if you subscribe it goes down to like 25 plus shipping but even that will still be over $30 and I don't know if I feel like this would be worth $30 to pay every month so I don't know I'm gonna keep thinking about it I might get the next one I might not I haven't decided if you have any um, subscription kits that you think I should check out definitely leave them down below um, I already get the freckled fawn one and I get the beautiful mess both of them but those are ending I think in March or April so I'm kind of looking to get a replacement for the beautiful mess ones so anyway thanks for watching you guys I'll see you in the next one bye I don't know, we shall find out together. I haven't even opened it yet. So let's see. So because I get both, um, they come in this nice box. So here's the Happy Meal, and then here is the messy box.